So a few years ago I made a video explaining how to make your music from your computer play on your Sonos system. But by reviewing the questions I realized that, well, I didn't explain exactly what people want. So there is three ways to make your computers play on your Sonos system. So the first one will be if you have MP3 files or uh, I don't know, your uh, iTunes library or any music file that you have on your computer. Well, you want to come on your computer. On the Sonos application itself, you don't have to care if it's a Mac or a PC. You go in Preference and you will find this music library where you can press the plus and you will have the choice to add a music folder. Uh, added music from a USB key or a drive that is connected on your PC or from an S and a hard drive on your network. Uh, this is where you want to go. And uh, it's pretty simple. You click on it, it's step by step. You just follow the instruction. But if you want me to explain you how to do it step by step with you, you can click on the link on the upper right corner and I'll explain you how to do it step by step. Then there is two other ways to make your music play from your computer on your Sonos system. If you want to play a video from YouTube, a video file that is on your computer, uh, you want to listen Netflix on your computer and make it play on your Sonos system, uh, this is not files on your, on your computer, or, uh, you will have to connect your computer on the input of a Sonos device. Not every Sonos device has an input. There is the Play 5, the Sonos 5, the Sonos Port, the Sonos Amp, or the Sonos Connect. Those are the five devices where you can connect a cable from your computer to the, the Sonos device. And those devices with the input, once it's connected, it is able to play it on any speaker in your house. So if you have a Play 5 beside your computer, you can take 3.5 millimeter stereo cable to a 3.5 millimeter stereo cable and connect it on your Sonos Play 5. This is very cheap and uh, I've got links for you in the description if you want to order it on Amazon. So if your computer is connected to a Play 5, well, all of your other devices in the house is able to play what's in the Play 5 connected with the wire. And if you go on the Sonos Connect, Connect Hemp or Port, uh, well, it, you will need a 3.5 millimeter stereo cable to a RCA cable, which is also very cheap and available in the description. The other way would be to, and for that last one option, you will need a Mac. Uh, or uh, maybe if you have a little software to emulate AirPlay. AirPlay is an Apple technology, that, that's why I said uh, you need a Mac. And uh, with the Mac, with the AirPlay, you just go on the upper right corner of your Mac and you select the AirPlay logo and you will be able to select a Sonos device to make the music play on. But this option is less re reliable than the cable itself because um, AirPlay is not a very stable technology and you will have compression on the sound, so the quality will be lower and there is a slight delay. So if you want to listen to a movie, well, that's not a great option. So yeah, that was the three options. So first one, you take the files from your computer with the settings and all the files will be available uh, from every apps to play on the system. Second option, take your computer, a cable connected to a compatible input device from Sonos and it will be available for all of your Sonos player. And the last one is the AirPlay. Oh, I forget, not all Sonos devices are AirPlay compatible. You will need a new generation of Sonos. So those one who are uh, compatible with the voice recognition, so the Sonos 1, the Sonos 5, uh, the Sonos Base or the little bar, not the play bar, the, the, the smaller one. Those ones are voice recognition uh, compatible, so they are also AirPlay compatible. You also have the Sonos Move, which is AirPlay compatible. Sonos Move, by the way, have a Bluetooth input, but this one is not shareable with the other devices and need to be disconnected from the Wi-Fi to make the Bluetooth play. 
So yes, you can make your computer play by Bluetooth on a Sonos Move, but this one will not be able to share it with the other devices. So yeah, that's all the option. So this is it. Thank you for watching. I hope it helps. If yes, please make a thumbs up. If you have any question, please ask in the comment below. I may simply answer you or even maybe make a video just for you. So don't forget to subscribe. And what you do see back there, it's from my main channel. So please come take a look at this right there. Thank you for watching again. See ya.